Are you guys ready to have some fun? Well, I was planning on asking you a second time, but that was so good. I don't know if I need to, but I'm going to do it again. Are you guys ready to have some fun? I'm feeding off of your energy. As you can tell, my class has had a lot of fun lately. And why, you ask? You want to know why? It's because we have gone from students to superheroes in just one short month, thanks to Lord's Lane and the Super U curriculum that she has created and has so gracefully and enthusiastically brought to our classroom and now bringing to the whole school. We have become the super pirates of Crew 202, and it's time to let these superheroes tell you their story. So give it up for the super pirates of Crew 202. Before we start things off, we would like to ask everybody, what do you think a superhero is? Okay. Mr. Glasses. I think a superhero is someone who Fights villains, smashes through walls, has like thruster boosters and laser eyes. Do you have anybody else? Pink cape. Okay, thank you. Um, I think a superhero is when you crash things and fight villains and fly and climb up walls and do cool stuff. Cool. Okay. Mrs. Rainbow. I think a superhero is someone who is like pow pow, bam bam, die villain, and they like shoot lasers and they're like invisible, like. That is one type of superhero, but that's not the type of superhero we're talking about. Superhero you're talking about is the destructive kind of superhero that destroys things. But a superhero is you. You and the person next to you. A superhero is an everyday person who brings their best self every day. So basically, a superhero is somebody who changes the world in their own unique way. A superhero can be a teacher, a teacher because they educate you, a policeman because they protect you, and a student because they make up the next generation. Hope you haven't been inspired to come together and change the world. Now that you know who a superhero is, it's time to find your own unique superpowers. Three kinds of superpowers. Positive character okay. trait, a wish superpower, and a challenge crushing superpower. The positive character trait superpower is a trait that you already have that makes you unique and that makes you feel more confident. Your wish character trait is when you wish you had a character trait that you don't have yet but you really want. An example is someone may wish to be more brave, so if they choose brave as their superpower, they will work towards becoming that. A challenge crushing superpower is a, a challenge crushing character trait is something you're afraid to do but you do anything in the world to conquer. For example, you're using courage to talk in front of many people like a whole school. Right now, we're crushing that challenge. And remember, you can choose that power. It can be any kind of power, and it can be more than one. Now go out and change the world with your new power! smile and I feel so empowered. Well, what does it mean to feel empowered? Golly, my gee! Tigris, you don't know what it means to be empowered? Well, I don't know what it means to be empowered either. Pink Rand, you don't know what it means to be empowered too? Mr. Kindness, we should teach them what it means to be empowered. What 
I think being empowered means is to be inspired. What I think it means is to be happy and full of energy. Well, does it mean to believe in yourself? Yeah. And to want to change the world? Yeah. yeah. Woo, we did it, yay! Empowerment also means to have a lot of power. For instance, I'm Mr. Kindness and I feel empowered. Go, Mr. Kindness, we feel your power. All right, let's try the class now. Oh, let's try the class now. I'm Mr. Kindness and I feel empowered. Go, Mr. Kindness, we feel your power. Let's try all you guys. I'm Mr. Kindness and I feel empowered. Go, Sorry, guys. <laughs> that was a little quiet. Let's try that one more time. Come on, Mr. Kindness. All right. I'm Mr. Kindness, and I feel empowered. Go, Mr. Kindness. Okay. situations. My name is Lotus Flower and I feel empowered. My name is Rainbow Woman. My superpower is kindness and I inspire others to make people feel good. My name is Rainbow Woman and I feel empowered. My name is Colorful Man and my superpower is being expressive. And when I'm expressive, others unleash their true colors. My name is Colorful Man and I feel empowered! My name is Burning Fern and my superpower is creativity. And when I use creativity, I inspire others to be creative so they can create anything. I'm Burning Fern and I feel empowered. Go, Burning Fern! My name is Courageous Creator. My power is courage. I'm courageous because when I step up, it makes others want to also. My name is Courageous Creator, and I feel empowered. Go, Courageous Creator! We feel your power! My name is Pink Crane. My superpower is creativity, and I help people find their creativity inside them to change the world. My name is Pink Crane, and I feel empowered. My name is Giving Tree and my superpower is selflessness. And I share the spotlight with others. My name is Giving Tree and I feel empowered. My name is Firecracker. My superpower is being energetic. And when I'm energetic, I make others smile. My name is Be my name is Firecracker and I feel empowered. My name is the go-to man. My superpower is being resourceful, and I change the world by making people think of other things that they normally wouldn't think of. My name is the go-to man, and I feel empowered. My name is Gumball. My superpower is enthusiasm, and I try to make people more enthusiastic in sad situations. My name is Gumball, and I feel empowered. My name is Flower King. My superpower is hopefulness. And when I walk into the room, everybody feels like they can do anything. My name is Flower King, and I feel empowered. Hey, my, name, my name is Flash. Flash. My superpower is energy. I give a person my kingdom and energy. My name is Flash, and I feel empowered. My name is Joe. My superpower is humor. And I make people feel joyful and I make them laugh. My name is Joe. And I feel empowered. My name is the Imaginaire. My superpower is imagination. And when I use imagination, I to use their imagination to change the world. My name is the Imaginaire and I feel empowered. Oh, 
is Lioness Pirate. And my superpower is courage. And when I use courage, I inspire others to take risks. But I wasn't always this way. I was actually the shyest kid in my class. And I wouldn't do things that I now have courage to do. I chose courage as my wish superpower. And now I'm able to do things that I would have never dreamed of doing before. For example, I'm going to do something for you that I haven't done in 20 years. of love and empowerment and I empower people to empower and I inspire leaders to lead. My name is Shine and I feel empowered. have a superhero team to back them up. We are the superpowers of Crew 202. Sorry. Today
Today we will discuss how important it is for superheroes to have a superhero team to back them up. Trust me, it's important. When you are part of a team, you have more encouragement, more energy, more teamwork, and more people believe in you. And you have more people to believe in. Without our superhero team, we wouldn't feel as empowered as we do, and we might, and we might not be here doing this show right now. Yes. One, two, three. One. Go superhero team. Go superhero team. So obviously, as you can see, we're superheroes and we want to give back to our world. And one of the ways we did this was Just Click. Just Click um, is a project that students come up with their own topics to work on to change the world. Let's say you wanted to save greyhounds. After you would show this project to parents and sponsors, we actually decided to raise money to go to foundations that could spread and support our idea. Wonder how we raised the money and supplies that we needed? Thanks to our parents, we were able to do this. Um, the five foundations we raised money for were the Imagination Foundation, the Water Project, World Wildlife, um, Perkins School for the Blind, the Na and the Native American Heritage Foundation. All of the, we, we uh, got, we got a lot of donations for all the org organizations, but we didn't count them yet. We'll tell you them tomorrow. We also collected items such as books, small solar panels, items for greyhounds, signs, and pledges to Community Harvest Project. We are, we are superheroes, superheroes and we can change the world. special talents and skills. Now that we are superheroes, we have the power to be, to be brave and have the confidence to shine. We, we love, love to play ball. ball! I'm a great shortstop. I'm a great third baseman. I'm also a great third base. I'm a great pitcher. I'm a great catcher. I'm a great hitter. Play ball! to play music. I was inspired by my class to follow my dream as a violinist. I'm a great pianist, and I just learned how to play this thing. to rap and act.
Hey, Caramino, bro. You want a cappuccino? No. Breath. Breath. Super U curriculum in the Broadway musical Chick Six. Lastly, she is very passionate about what she does. The song I Am a Superhero is an amazing poem and teaches us a little bit more about poetry. In the song I Am a Superhero, Lords empowers others to empower to be a superhero and just empower every day, to bring your superpower to everything you do so you can do your best, and to like yourself the way you are, because if you don't, you can't find superpower which represents your inner beauty. So are you ready to hear the song? Yeah. Introducing Lawrence Lane and the Super Pirates of Crew 202. How are you guys? Are you feeling like superheroes? I said, are you feeling like superheroes now? Great, so then I will sing something and you will sing right after me. You got that? I said, I'm going to sing something you're going to sing right after me. Are you ready? I am a superhero. I rise above strife. I have a superpower. Call it my life. Call it my life. Give yourselves a hand. Give yourselves a hand. And now we're going to sing a song. And now that you know what to do, you guys are going to sing along with me like superheroes. Are you ready? Yeah. I said, are you ready? Yeah. Okay, here we go.
Um, I just want to thank you guys for coming. I want to thank you for being a part of this. And probably I forgot something huge when I was talking about my superpower. I used courage to connect with Lord's Lane and actually put Super U into my classroom. And if I didn't have the courage to try something new like that, then we wouldn't have had a chance to be in front of all of you, hopefully empowering students, parents, and teachers today. So I'm so glad that you were such an amazing audience. And I would just like to uh, recognize Lord's Lane one more time. Just give her and the superheroes behind me a huge round of applause and yourselves. Thank you so much. You are all superheroes. Remember.